Obituary. Ida Lewis Wilson. Newport, Rhode Island, October 24. Death Tonight claimed Ida Lewis Wilson, keeper of Lime Rock Light for more than half a century, heroine of numerous thrilling rescues, and frequently alluded to as the gray starling of America. Mrs. Wilson, for her full name was Mrs. Ida Lewis Wilson, was stricken with apoplexy while at her post of duty on Friday night, and was found unconscious by her brother, who lived with her. Saturday morning. From that moment to the moment of her death she never regained consciousness. For some years it had been the custom of Mrs. Wilson to rise before her brother and awaken him. Saturday morning she failed to call him, and when he awoke he found her stretched out on the floor of her apartment. In order to get a physician it was necessary for Lewis to row to the mainland, for Lime Rock has no telephonic communication. When the physician arrived he found the patient in such a weakened condition that he held out no hope for her recovery. During the three days that the famous lifesaver lay at the point of death letters and telegrams of sympathy had poured in, and so many flowers had been received that it was not possible to transport all to the lighthouse. Colonel William H. Coffin, Commandant of the Narragansett Defense District, announced tonight that he had received instructions from the War Department to suspend target practice at Forts Adams and Wetherill during the illness of Ida Lewis. The instructions came too late. However, for the woman, was dead when Colonel Coffin announced receipt. During the past few days the continued booming of the guns disturbed the patient considerably and jarred the lighthouse, with the result that last night the matter was taken up with the Washington officials. Ida Lewis was the only woman to be officially appointed to the charge of an American lighthouse. As the keeper of Lime Rock Light, in Newport Harbor, for more than half a century, she had saved 18 lives, some of them at great personal risk. Her deeds of daring carried her fame throughout the world, and she received many honors, including medals, a life pension and the thanks of Congress.